Hello everyone, my name is Neil and welcome to our exam exercise walkthrough from ESLLounge.com. Today we're working through C1 Advanced, Multiple Choice Close, exercise number CAE003. Let's start with number one. Much of the neighbourhood was demolished in the 1940s when living blank had deteriorated. The options are situations, conditions, circumstances and states. The correct answer is conditions. Conditions refers to the circumstances affecting the way people live or work. For example, the working conditions in the factory were poor. This indicates the environment and factors impacting the workers. In this context, conditions describes the state of the neighbourhood's living environment. Moving on to question number two. Scientists are yet to understand the full nutritional blank of the humble olive. The options are favours, helps, goods and benefits. The correct answer is benefits. Benefits refers to advantages or profits gained from something. For example, regular exercise has many health benefits, indicating positive effects. In this context, benefits describes the nutritional advantages of olives. Question 3. You can come and blank us performing this operation if you want. The options are discover, gaze, observe and look. The correct answer is observe. Observe means to watch carefully, especially in order to learn something. For example, doctors observed the patient's condition closely. This indicates careful monitoring. In this context, observe invites someone to watch the operation. The main distractor in this question is gaze. Gaze means to look steadily and intently, especially in admiration, surprise or thought. For example, she gazed out of the window at the sunset. In this context of performing an operation, observe means to watch carefully, especially with the intent of learning or understanding something. You will also notice that gaze usually needs the preposition at, which is not present here. Here's question four. Bears used to be very blank in this part of the country, but nobody has seen one for 10 years. The options are sparse, broad, thorough and widespread. The correct answer is widespread. Widespread means found or distributed over a large area. For example, the disease was widespread in the area. This indicates it was common. In this context, widespread describes how common bears used to be. Moving on to question five. Ben was blank to the court for jury duty, but took a doctor's note with him and was excused. The options are pulled, assembled, summoned and requested. The correct answer is summoned. Summoned means to officially call someone to attend a place. For example, he was summoned to appear in court. This indicates an official request to attend. In this context, summoned refers to being called for jury duty. Next is question six. The police blank four states in pursuit of the bank robber. The options are crossed, journeyed, chased and travelled. The correct answer is crossed. Crossed means to move across a particular area, to traverse. For example, they crossed the desert on foot, indicating movement across an area. In this context, crossed describes the police moving across multiple states and their borders. Question 7. After three years of blank, the country's economy is finally looking a lot healthier. The options are let down, demise, overdraft and recession. The correct answer is recession. Recession means a period of temporary economic decline. For example, the country is recovering from a recession. This indicates a time of economic downturn. In this context, recession describes the country's economic state, which is not good. The main distractor in this question is demise. It typically signifies a final and irreversible end, such as the demise of ancient civilizations. While demise means a complete cessation in economic terms, recession is more fitting as it describes not an end, but a downturn that is generally reversible and temporary. And now, finally, question eight. 
we altered our final blank of yearly profits due to more accurate advertising and marketing costs. The options are forecast, expectancy, expectation, and wishes. The correct answer is forecast. Forecast means a prediction or estimate of future events. For example, the weather forecast predicts rain. This indicates an estimate of future weather. In this context, forecast refers to the prediction of yearly profits. The main distractor in this question is expectation. Expectation generally refers to a belief about what should happen, such as she had high expectations for her new job, where it implies a personal or subjective outlook. In contrast, forecast is more objective and often data-driven, making it suitable for contexts like financial planning. Forecast describes a prediction based on analysis. That's all for today from ESLLounge.com. Thanks for joining me. See you next time.